Well, today, Harris County jail officials provided an update on conditions at that facility. Good evening. I'm Caroline Collins. And I'm Anthony Antoine. Family members of inmates who have died while in custody spoke in Austin, pleading for change in the inside of that detention center. Fox 26's Sherman DeSell joins us live downtown to break down today's meeting. Yeah, good evening, Anthony and Caroline. State officials, they're asking for more accountability from officials here at the Harris County Jail after the noncompliance issues continue, overcrowding and in custody deaths of inmates. Some of the family members of those inmates spoke to the commission today, hoping that something will be done. No one deserves the death sentence while waiting their day in court. Jocelyn Griffin joined several Houston area residents in Austin pleading for reform in the Harris County Jail. Her son, Evan Griffin Lee, was one of 27 people who died while in custody last year. What is your plan to make them accountable? The deaths are on the rise in 2023. The facility now faces an escalated enhanced enforcement from the State Commission of Jail Standards since they failed two inspections in the last year. They've been non-compliant with in-custody deaths, staffing, overcrowding, and holding inmates in excess of 48 hours through the booking process. The interim assistant chief says the delayed booking process has many factors in the criminal justice system. One of them has to do with the DA's office. So what we see is usually a holdup with our um, the DA's office clearing charges. It kind of backs up our system. The jail currently houses over 7,900 inmates. Over 1,300 of them are outsourced to other counties. The average length of stay for an inmate is over 200 days. That's three times the average amount for other county jails in the state. The commission's now requesting an additional plan of action from the jail and asking for a letter of concurrence or agreement from the county judge's office. Families of those who have died in custody are urging the state for thorough investigations and true change. Each human in the facility represents a community. If they fall, the whole community fall. Now, the commission did say that the latest inspection in June indicates that this facility has been trying to work on those noncompliance issues, but they want to see more done, and they want to include other agencies in the county. Reporting from the Harris County Jail, Sherman DeSalle, Fox 26 News.